guys, so today I'm going to be filming one of my most requested videos ever. This is my most requested video that has ever been requested. You guys want it, I didn't want to film it, but here I am giving you what you want. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how I do my eyelash extensions at home because you can pay like 50 to 100 pounds in a shop and I do this for like these are like four pound a pack, the glue is like three pound, and then you need tweezers, so let's say ten pound. I do eyelash extensions at home for ten pounds and it takes me ten minutes per eye, so you know, weigh up your options guys, weigh up your options. So today I'm going to show you guys how I do it, it is the most simple thing, it is so so easy. Honestly, that's why I didn't want to film this video, because I thought it was just so self-explanatory, it's literally me going... So you know, it's the easiest thing, I hope you guys enjoy and I'm just going to get into it. So I've moved really really close to you right now, it's a little bit brighter on this side of my face so it might look a little bit weird but it's the best I can do right now. So as you can see I have really short eyelashes, you can't really see them because they're blonde so you know, blonde eyelashes problems, you literally can't see them. So to do my eyelashes what I use is the Duo Individual Lash Glue. You can get so many different ones, you can get like a salon system one, you can get so many different glues. This is just one that I use and I like to use it in black so it kind of blends in to your lash line and makes your eyelashes look a little bit thicker as well. And I like to use the Superdrug um, eyelash extensions. I'm pretty sure they're like £5 a pack. I'll usually use like two packs and if I want to go for a little bit of a thicker look I'll add an extra pack. Um, these are really inexpensive, you can get more expensive ones that are a little bit better than these I guess but these do the trick and they work perfectly fine for me. Um, you don't want to get ones with, can you see the little bands at the top here? These are like, I don't know what these are called, I think they might be cluster lashes or something like that. But the bands there you don't want it to be too thick because then it's obvious that your eyelashes aren't real. What I like to do is I like to take the little bit of plastic off the top of the eyelashes and do a big glob of glue. About this much should be enough for one eye and then you'll need more for the other eye. So all you do, it's so simple, you just grab the pack of eyelashes, get your tweezers and pull them out. You're going to hold the eyelashes like so, it is so hard for you to see this eyelash, it is so tiny. You're literally going to dip the base, you're going to dip the base in the glue like so, so it's got a quite, you can see the base a little bit better now. And now, you can wait a few seconds for the eyelash to go tacky or whatever, and then obviously I've got the longest one, so I'm just going to pop that right on my lash line, like so, and that's literally it, that's, you just do that and repeat. I lipstick on today, and I think it just looks so stupid on me, honestly, like, I hate lipstick on. With the next one, obviously you want to put it as close to the other one that you put on as possible, and then just lay it down. This is why I didn't want to make this video, because it's literally the easiest thing ever. Now I'm moving on to the middle row of eyelashes, these ones, and I've put them all up here so it's easier for me to pick them up. If you're wondering what these lengths are, I'm not entirely sure, but I'm going to make a guess that they are probably 12, 8, and 4 millimeters. so 12 being the longest, 8 being the middle set and 4 being the shortest. Because if you go on eBay to buy these eyelashes, they're a lot cheaper, but usually they don't come in sets like this. So you've got to know the millimeters. It just makes it a little bit more gradient if you have all of those lengths. It's honestly the simplest thing ever to do. That's why I didn't want to make the video because it's just kind of self-explanatory. Like, I didn't even watch a video to figure out how to do this. I just, you know, did it. Sometimes what I like to do, if they all kind of look the same length, is I'll get my fingers like so, grab onto the lashes and push them back into like the root of where my lashes are, I guess. And sometimes I just take my tweezers and just push them down a little bit. I found that with the complete individual eyelashes, that it was so hard to take makeup off, that it was so hard to wash my face. And I also found that they were like ripping out my eyelashes as well when they came out, like eyelashes were always attached to them. And that never ever happens with these unless I physically pull them out, which I've done a few times. Something I do recommend with these eyelashes is when you take them off, when they 
start looking a little bit funky or they're kind of growing out a little bit and you think, oh, I need to do like a new set, is that when you take them off, be sure to wash your eyes like thoroughly. That's what I do. As soon as I take them off um, to do a new set, like I took these off last night, because sometimes it's nice to sleep without eyelashes because you do have to be a little bit careful when you're sleeping. So that is the first eye. I'm just gonna cover this one up so you guys can see properly. That is the first eye done. As you can see, it's a big difference to this eye. It adds so much difference, and obviously you don't have to wear mascara with them. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna do this eye, and then I'll be back with you. Everything will glow for you. Go get punched for the love club. For the love club. So that is literally how I put my eyeliner extensions on. It is so, so easy. I bet loads of you guys are going to be like, oh. Oh, I didn't realize. <laughs> After you watch this, because it's so simple, it's so easy, and it's so quick. Yeah, uh, it's good. It's a good time. So just in case you were wondering what products I use, I'm going to go over it really, really quick again. So the eyelashes that I use are these ones from Superdrug. I like the ones from Eyelaw a little bit better, but they are a little bit pricier. They're like £7 a pack, I think, and these are like usually £4. And obviously there's like the long ones in there, there's the medium ones and the short ones. If you're going on eBay to buy these eyelashes, then you want the 12mm, the 8mm and the 4mm to do the long, the medium, the short. They're very cheap. They're like £2 a pack on eBay. I also use the Duo Eyelash Glue in black. I have this one, I have the one in just a clear one, and I have a Salon System one in black and one in clear as well. doesn't really matter what glue you use. Definitely don't use the little one that it comes with in the pack, like this thing here. The little white thing it comes with, don't use that. They'll last like two days. This helps me stay on for... I probably do these once a month, I guess. I redo these once a month. And then obviously a pair of tweezers. These ones are from, I have no idea. <laughs> Doesn't even have a name on there with my mom's, but they're amazing. I definitely say invest in some quality tweezers. I know that Sainsbury's have some really good ones actually, but I think like the big heavy metal tweezers are the best ones, not the lightweight ones. If you pick up a pack and it feels kind of heavy, get those ones because they're probably a lot better. And that's literally everything I use. It's so simple, so quick. And I hope you enjoyed this video because you guys have been asking for it so, so much. I love you guys so much and I will see you on Saturday with another video. Bye!